Good morning. Here is your daily crypto market update from Seba, the bank for the new economy. Major cryptocurrencies rallied on Tuesday as the global crypto market cap rose 1.9% to $1.95 trillion. The crypto markets decoupled from traditional markets, which witnessed a risk-off move for a second straight day as the Ukraine-Russia crisis escalated. Bitcoin spiked to test the $45,000 resistance and moved into bullish territory on Tuesday. The cryptocurrency made intraday swing highs of $44,980 and faced resistance at $45,000, before moving down back towards $44,000. The cryptocurrency looks bullish and might breach $45,000 today. If the cryptocurrency fails to breach $45,000, we could see a fresh soft towards $40,000. Bitcoin was consolidating and trading at $44,270, above the 100-hour moving average at the time of publication. Immediate support on the downside is at $42,000 followed by $40,000, while on the upside $45,700 and $47,000 are the next major resistance levels. And that's our crypto market update for today. We wish you a great day ahead. For more information about Seba Bank, Visit Seba.Swiss. This document has been prepared by Seba Bank AG, Seba, in relation to its activities in Switzerland. Seba is a Swiss bank and securities dealer with its head office and legal domicile in Switzerland. It is authorized and regulated by the Swiss Financial Market Supervisory Authority, FINMA. This document is for your information only and is not intended as an offer or a solicitation of an offer to buy or sell any investment or other specific product. The information contained herein does not constitute a personal recommendation or take into account particular investment objectives, investment strategies, financial situation and needs of any specific recipient. Certain products and services of SEBA are not accessible to residents and or nationals of certain countries. Certain services and products are subject to legal restrictions and cannot be offered on an unrestricted basis and or may not be eligible for sale to certain investors. Recipients are therefore asked to consult the sales restrictions relating to products or services in question for further information. Furthermore, recipients may consult their legal or tax advisors should they require any clarifications.